I don't know if you was around Biggie when this happened, like in real time when it actually happened, but do you remember his reaction when Tupac got killed? Um, I mean, he definitely was like rattled. He was, he was not happy. You know what I mean? It was, he was kind of fucked up about it. It definitely was not, you know, yay, he's dead. Like it was definitely like a, a serious moment for him because you know, at one point they was cool. You know what I mean? Don't nobody want to hear about somebody dying that they once was cool with. So, yeah, it was just more, you know, like a, that's fucked up, like, because it was. And I heard he was a big fan of the Machiavelli album, right? Um, He just played it in the car a few times, like, you know what I mean? Like, Big wasn't the kind of person that would put whatever like his personal feelings against somebody's music just because of how he felt about them like it was probably plenty of people that he didn't specifically care for personally you know what i mean on a let's hang out let's be cool to but love their music so you know what i mean he listened to all kinds of music so he definitely was a a fan of his music you know what i mean it didn't have his personal feelings toward him didn't have anything to do with with the craft. Right, right. And you recall him playing Machiavelli, that album? Mm-hmm. Absolutely. Yep. I sure do. You remember the record? Nah. I don't remember the record. Damn, you want me to have an elephant memory on me right now. Like, that was a long, long time ago. No, I don't remember what specific record. I re I know I re I do remember I I actually that he liked um Hail Mary. He liked that one. But what he was consistently knocking off of that album, no, I don't remember. Right, right, but he did fuck with Hail Mary though, so. Mm-hmm.